bunch of legends at the last blockade there. Uh, they waved me down while we're going and took me up up and over the hills to uh, bypass another blockade. So nothing like following Colombian strangers deep into the woods, but it worked out this time. What a day, what a day. You know, the, uh, the toughest part about trying to share this journey with you guys is that the GoPro, the iPhones just don't show the beauty. They don't show how amazing the roads are. They don't show how gnarly the roads are. So it's, it's pretty tough. And I'm trying to be interesting too about it. Thanks, Velez, another wicked little town. And uh, thanks to my hotel room that was $8.40 and had a toilet seat. That's a win. Well, you guys know me, only the best for Alfonso in hotel rooms. Uh, this is a first though. I got a sponsor for a video. Two sponsors actually, Blake and Rossi. Absolute legends boys, thanks for helping out. Appreciate it. This is actually $15, but it's all to myself. 
And thanks to Nada and Gregory for helping out too. Appreciate that, you guys. Well, the advantage of uh, not knowing where you're going is uh, you get to get some really cool little towns like that last one, Belez. Very cool little spot. to guess. Saw two fellow solo riders today going the other direction. Big smiles, big waves. That's the kind of shit that makes my day. Puerto Barrio, yeah, funky little port town. Lots of construction, lots of parties going on. It's gonna be fun for one night. Okay, everyone, uh, what's Al's accommodation like? This is $11, let's give you the tour. Bathroom, shower, bed, fan, TV, and here's, I'm calling this my personal patio. I pretty much got the corner suite. Bienvenido Puerto Barrio. Okay, Puerto Barrio, don't know much about ya. Had a good look around last night. You've been fun, but it's time to hit the road. I'm gonna get an early start. It's eight o'clock. I'm just zipping through the toll gates and not being in the lineup. Like those big trucks. I just passed like 30 people like that. It was awesome. 
What a great day. Today has been a massive day. I'm at about, I gotta be close to 500 kilometers so far. And road hasn't been that exciting. It's still good. Bike's running like a fucking champ. And I changed my mind about four different times today. So I'm just trying to pound out some kilometers. And uh, I should be in very Northern Columbia by tomorrow. Tiene un costo de un salario y el vehículo va para patio. ¿Oye? Disculpe, yo entiendo un poco. Ok, ya le, ya, ya le explico cómo es. Ok. Gracias. Buen día. Guess who was driving like an asshole today and got caught by the cops? They wanted 350,000, but I gave them 100,000. That's good negotiation. So, to celebrate, I'm crushing this beer. Yesterday I did over 700 kilometers. That's too much. I don't enjoy driving at night. I haven't driven at night in a long time. And uh, it turns out I got no dash lights. So for the last hour and a half, it was uncomfortable. I won't be doing that again. Lesson learned. Not the best way to start the day, but at least I was uh, 100 feet from a repair shop. Well, you're always 100 feet from a repair shop. Okay, dollar 68 to fix the <laughs> the tire. Dollar 68 to fix the tire. Oh, Colombia, I love you. Hey, I 
Costa Talla Proximida or Lo Siento, you have Ron Poco de Espanol. Necesario, si, sí. era. Or Pasibla Yanteria, aquí, no. Uh, ¿Cuántos? Aquí, a la esquina, ahí, a It's hot, hot, hot here. Uh, big thanks to everyone for helping me out though. It's tough to swallow ego and pride and ask for help, but sometimes you gotta do it, especially when I'm not working this winter. So thanks legends, I appreciate it. I'll only spend some of the money on cocaine and midget hookers. Gracias, buen día.